Sorry. Hello again. I was just checking that the video was recording. Welcome again to today's attempt at the Nerdle puzzle. I'm trying to identify a true mathematical equation. And that's not a good start because it's always more difficult, I think, when the equals is not in that position. So it's either a three-digit answer or a one-digit answer, and I don't know which. Still could be division to get down to a low number, or it could be multiplication to get to a three-digit number. So, um, I don't know what to go for. Let's try 10 divided by 5 plus 7, because then we use new digits plus the 3 that we already knew about. Oh, and so it is a one-digit answer, but it's probably a three-digit number divided by a two-digit number to get down to that one-digit answer. So it's a long division sum, which always makes it a lot more difficult. And we still don't know most of the digits, 5, 7, 9, and 0, but we still produce a 4 or a 6, or both. Um, and it still could have a multiplication in it, could be something times something divided by something. If I can think of something that works, I'll try it. We've got the 0 though, so that's very suspicious. Are we going to be multiplying by 5 and then dividing by 10? or dividing by a multiple of 10, because we can't actually divide by 10. Let's try 5 times, let's actually start at the beginning. So 5 times, 5 times 70, that wouldn't be divisible by 9. 5 times 90 would be 450, which is not divisible by 7. If it's 7 times 90, because we do have to use the 7 of a 9, and being prime and only having one real divisor, respectively, um, make it quite difficult. We're not going to be able to get a 5 involved here, are we? So let's forget that. Interesting struggling with this one, as you can see. Uh, 720, we can't use that. I'm just trying to think of something that would be divisible by 9, or divisible by a um, a multiple of 9. If it's divisible by 95, that would be 180, 360. I mean, 720 is divisible by 95, but we can't use the 2. So if it is divided by 95, what's 7 times 95? That's 675. I'm going to try that. It can't be correct because we haven't used the zero. Um, no, it's 665, isn't it? But still, I'm going to try it. So there's no 6, and there's only one 5, so at least we've got divide by 90 something correct. What's, so 5 times 97, that wouldn't work because we wouldn't be using the zero. I feel like it's going to have to be 700 and something. But this can't be a 9 or a 7, so the highest that the answer can be is 5. Which means that this can't actually be a 7, because it has to be 400 and something or 500 and something. Clearly I should have used a 4 instead of a 6 in the last one and then we would have more information. That is going to be 470, isn't it? So that's definitely a possible answer. There we go. That was a very difficult one today. Quite slow. Only four guesses, so I'm quite happy with that. But long division sums always make this go a lot slower. So if you stuck with me till the end, thank you for watching. That's the Nerdle Puzzle, and bye for now.